Something I don't think people realize is my experience with AI or ChatGPT is much different from yours. Even if we ask the same yes. question, yes. it will say something different. Right. I didn't realize this. Me and my friends were debating who was the best soccer player in the world. And I said Messi. My friend said Ronaldo. So we both went and asked our ChatGPTs the same question and it said two different things. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, this reminds me of the social media problem, which is that people think when they open up their news feed, they're getting mostly the same news as other people. And they don't realize that they've got a supercomputer that's just calculating the news for them. If you remember in the social element, there's the trailer. Yeah. And if you typed in uh, into Google, climate change is. And then depending on what your location, it would say not real versus real versus, you know, a made up thing. It wasn't trying to optimize for truth. It was just optimizing for what the most popular queries were in those different locations. I think that that's a really important lesson when you look at things like AI companions, where children and regular people are getting different answers based on how they interact with it.